Welcome back, friends. Michael Butler here with Denise O'Brien, Dome Entertainment, and Peace Train, the movie. Yes. Tell us what's the latest. What's new? Well, let's see. The latest is that we're working on the funding of the film and we're adding more people to the team. And the budget is growing because we have new players. And uh, what's most exciting is that we're expanding the list of potential A-list ladies. Oh, that, movie, that's which exciting. Is really exciting. We originally had Gal Gadot. And we've also added a few new women, some leading ladies that I know Renee is very, very excited about. And also, we're looking at some of the... Um, children from Stranger Things, which is oh, the latest wow. new hot, yeah. hot uh, Netflix series, award-winning uh, characters in that show, uh, for some of the children at the camp. And as we talked about, it starts out as a, as a peace camp for 12 to 13 year olds. So I actually asked my 14 year old daughter, who do you think are some of the latest and greatest actors of ask all a time? Kid, right? If you want to know, would, ask your kid. That's right. <laughs> that, we would, that we want to have in our movie of children because some of the, the children I've worked with have grown up in the last four right, or five years. Right. Like we had Boo Boo Stewart, you know, he's oh, practically yeah. an adult now. He is. So we're adding some new younger characters to uh -huh. the investor memo to increase the value of the cast. That, and we yeah. also increased the budget a bit, just slightly, to include some A list celebrities, which is a really exciting opportunity for us to have that mm -hmm. going for us and the investors like to see that too. The investors I know Renee, are excited you're... about yeah. big time <laughs> named people. Well, mm -hmm. I, I like Renee as the co-executive producer of you. That's right. You all are, you're always collaborating. I do whatever she says. <laughs> <laughs> well, but, well, it is exciting. We've been hearing some great things, some great feedbacks from the audio book, the e-book, the print book. People mm -hmm. are saying, what's the latest? When can we go to the theater and right. see it? Right. Everybody wants to see the movie. And at the grand opening that we did at Ashland, yeah. we actually gave out little tickets. I we have did. one in my wallet for myself. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Um, for people my... to get to see the final cut right before yeah. we go to, you know, the final cut people can actually make a little you know yeah. thought or give us some intuition on how we should change it or move it around and Renee's really excited about including her local friends and supporters in that and she's got a lot of them and uh, at the, if you were at the gala in Ashland Oregon we rolled out the red carpet we're going to be, there. We'll be so rolling fun. out yeah. several red carpets that's right now and then. that's right we're gonna have one in Ashland we're gonna have one in Hollywood and I'm considering that we should have one in Israel too because I mean, that's, that's the home Shalom. of the story right yeah, yeah that's yeah. the home of the story so there's a new team member yeah, yes, I know it's very yes. exciting. It's, it is exciting. <laughs> this is the official first time <laughs> announcing row, row, row. that we have a new editor on the project that was referred to us by Craig Rosebrough, our co-director, oh, yeah. and it's Patrick Gambudi Jr. He is yes. an award right. Emmy Award winning, winning. Uh, Multiple editor. Emmy yes, award winning. yes. He he's worked on a lot of TV shows, a lot of independent films. You've seen his work. Yes, if you, you watch have. movies and you watch movies, I know you do like we do. You've seen his work. That's right. He has a great story about whales. He worked with Hillary Clinton's campaign. He's done a lot of really amazing things, and yeah. we're glad to have Patrick on board the Peace Train. Well, he's player. really happy to be working with us. Yes, you he know, is. He said yes, this he is. is a project he's very passionate about, not just as a job, but as a mission. Right. And uh, that's one thing I like about all of our team members who are very mission driven here. Mm -hmm. You talked about Evolve Ron and his passion and what he's done. Yes, with that's our award winning, Academy Award winning. Composer, uh, composer, yeah. and he has some really amazing ideas. We met with his studio. You might have seen a previous uh, broadcast of that. Having the opportunity to be with somebody that talented who is multicultural too. Yeah, and absolutely. it took Renee a long time to find him. She really, yeah. really searched him out. We're grateful to have him as uh -huh. part of our package and as part of the offering that we're making. How to important investors. is music to a movie, right? I mean, music. The most important. Yeah, it, yes. it makes the movie. And it also afterwards, you know, the soundtrack, everybody wants to hear it, and it, and it will it. last forever. So we're really excited about the songs that he's putting together, the multicultural, multilingual. You know, there's going to be other other songs, Absolutely. and um, some of them at the end are really um, tearjerkers already, from what I've seen. Well they, well, they are, and what we're seeing with the online following on social media is it's global. Mm -hmm. You know, there are friends and fans that are coming on, tons of positive comments, the feedback on the books, the feedback right. on the social media. At peacetrainmovie.com, when you like, comment, and share everything that's happening on a daily basis, it helps us um, prepare people for the rollout in the theater. So that's thank right. you so much. That's right. And, and Renee is so excited because her message is getting out there globally already. It is. Um, she loves the fact that everybody's following and listening, and mm. she enjoys interacting too. So if you haven't had a chance to write she Renee a note very... on the Peace Train, she'll write you one back. You know, all of us are excited about bringing people together because that's right. what the friendship pod 
is. You know, at the very end of the movie, there's something really special that happens that we don't want to ruin the, the story or the surprise, but there's an Please. opportunity for you to play a bigger space in your own life in communication, and there's actually a tool that you'll learn by watching the movie. So it's not just a happy or sad ending, it's actually an ending that makes a difference in the world, and, and we're talking about peace. Very positive mm -hmm. call to action that you can get involved in with your friends and family. That's right. So peacetrainmovie.com.